One of the parts of this piece that is, I think, universally fun to listen to, fun for everyone, <laughs> is the final movement. I think other parts of the piece are fun for other reasons, but the music is fun in this case, and it has a really rollicking quality. The beat itself isn't very fast, but what happens in the middle of the beat kind of gives it this momentum. So, da -da 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 da 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 And no matter what tempo you take it, it always feels like it's moving forward. So that's a fun thing to experiment with because the character is just so strong. And what he does with uh, the violin part, the solo violin part, is he adds these virtuoso elements in among that steady rhythm. So all of a sudden the violin goes from low to really high and like whoop, <laughs> yet the rhythm continues and it sounds really impressive. And it's not easy to play, but he knew how to write for violin to get the maximum effect out of the the concept that he had. So it's, uh, I think, I think that's kind of rock and roll, that movement. <laughs>